Okay, I'm gonna make a little short video here. Um, this is the part that I'm trying to cut up pretty simple. Uh, just gonna cut around the contour of here just to break out this part. Um, just really simple one line. Um, didn't try to do any swarf or anything like that. Just uh, one line. So in other words, basically goes around, comes back out, and that's it. So in other words, now if we flip over to mock, I got this set up in mock, already loaded the G code, already set up the uh, fixture, everything's at zero. Um, if you look at the absolute coordinates, um, all the absolute coordinates, this is going to tell me the maximum range in which it's going to actually uh, actually turn the head. So in other words, I'm I'm safe uh, in the, for the most part. It's, it's not going to do 360 degrees and snap a cable. So um, here we go. Um, you start the cycle. You'll see that it's moving the head. On the five axis, uh, it's going over, went up, and now it's going to do its cut. So it'll go around. As you can see, it's still sitting at a 25 degree angle. Now it angles around, it interpolates around that the corners. It's going to steady itself off. It's going to go pretty much straight. And then it'll interpolate again, go around that corner. Now it's done cutting. It's going to bring everything back to zero. And then it'll wrap it over to uh, the uh, start point. That's that's what I got right now. Uh, hopefully, uh, I'm going to test it on uh, an actual real machine to make sure it actually works. So, all right, stay tuned.